right, Caps. Nice lope. Oh. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. Oh. Ten, nine, I know, it's okay. Thank you. We're not going that way. Not going that way. Not going that way. Oh. Oh. Good. Oh. Steady. Steady, wild man. Steady. Steady. Oh, Capitan. Lope. We're novice. Woo. Steady. Good. That's better. No, not the trailers. Boy. Thank <laughs> you. 
So I'm going to give you guys a little breakdown of what we've just experienced. So for Cappy, um, and with this being a schooling show, and he did novice, so he went up a level from beginner novice. Um, and we've had a fair amount of cross-country schooling. And uh, I was actually able to come to Majestic Oaks a couple of days before, and we had schooled previously. So he can be a little funny about the water's edge, and he's also a little bit a barn sour. So right where this uh, combination is, it kind of sucks you into that because you have a jump right before the water. So... Uh, sometimes with the green horses and teaching them to be confident in the water, you need to actually go slower so they can read it. And if they get a little worried, it's okay. My uh, mistake was that I kind of assumed, well, I've already schooled the water here. He's He should be good about it. And I continued to canter uh, towards the water. So in doing so, it happened pretty fast. And for Cappy, he still just kind of went, ah, I'm going to decide to go back the other way, which he likes to do that stage left. Um, so I just stayed patient. And whenever horses are a little bit like that, just continuing to stay the course that I would like to go, which would be to the right. Um, and then I just kept encouraging him a little bit and to go into the water. So, you know, not that big of a deal. Again, you'll hear me say things like uh, I should have been smarter or um, kind of gone through the water. And also other things that you can do is because we're supposed to enter based upon where the flags are. Now you can be a little smart sometimes and kind of weave your way around if you don't want to get, if you have a horse that's a little worried about water um, and you can make sure you don't cross your tracks, but entering the water where it's not flagged, which is what, so you can prep the horse for going into water because essentially once you can get their feet in, they kind of then understand and then you can go and enter. Uh, also, sometimes when heading towards that water, as long as they're going forward, so if you have a kind of an angle spot and you can keep them inching forward and they're not stepping backwards, you're okay. Um, but, you know, all in all, I was pleased with him. It just shows that I need to do a little bit more homework in building his confidence in going into water. So, uh, and then he continues on to finish really well. This way. Should have been smarter about that. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. So. scary today. Good boy. Oh. Hey, I had probably like two stops at the water. Yeah. Yeah, because you know we're going away from trailers. That was way too fast. Now it's filming. God, why? <laughs> Wait, what? Is, is it yes. Do you see the screen? A little more. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> oh no! It actually, you're getting out of here. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Capitan. Ah, eh, mileage under the belt, buddy. Hey, right, let's go wash him off. You have to leave now. Best of luck. Thank you. Warmest of regards. Okay. Bye. 
Abby, you're so funny. My horse is leaving. You have to be a big boy. Hey, caps. <sighs> All right, Buster. Good boy.